Ronnie, a well-earned draw, especially a tough task after Gideon Zalalem picks up the red card in the 21st minute. But the second half, you have to be ecstatic about the determination and hunger that your squad showed. Uh, it was a great performance. Uh, we talked about in the break here that we have an uh, opportunity and we, we have everything to win. We just have to go out and, and go for it. And uh, the way the team responded was unbelievable. Uh, was uh, We were creating the chances. We uh, we scored a goal. Um, you know, it looks like we're 11-11, so against 11. So fantastic credit to the boys. Yeah, really outstanding second half performance, but the goal itself was pure determination, the willingness, the want, the desire from Tati Castellanos. I mean, that was an exceptional finish for him to move up to 19 goals. I mean, what about this guy is so special to you, Ronnie? Clearly going in the playoffs in style, he's confident and scoring goals. Yeah, he's, uh, he's a handful for every central defender. I've played central defender myself. Uh, in the old days, and uh, I would never play against him. I would, wouldn't like that, you know. He's, he can take you in the air, and he, he can take you uh, in the speed. He holds up the ball. He gives you a hard time in every, every challenge, and, and he's clinical when he's finished. So, and he can score with his left, right, and also in the air. So it's a, it's a great, great player, and he has much more to go. Ronnie, six goals for Tati in the last four matches, but overall, uh, a team that has found its stride after that rough patch here late in the season and what does that mean going into the playoffs and you're going to have to go up against an Atlanta team in which you had a win and a draw yeah it's going to be tough of course but uh, you know we, we go in that in, a, in the best way we possibly can you know we have uh, gone uh, five games unbeaten uh, we can stand 70 minutes now in the, with the, with 10 men and also get the result and win those that period so says something about what what what's in this team and um, we need to get everything out now against Atlanta we're looking forward to everything to win we just have to go for it and um, and then we'll see how good uh, they are Ronnie I've got to give you a pat on the back as well because you've been through a lot obviously the COVID protocol moving stadium for home stadium discipline problems and then obviously issues with injuries international call-ups but you have maintained your mentality pushing this team and you deserve a massive pat on the back for the job you have done with this club getting them into the playoffs yet again but how happy are you I mean what does this really mean to you personally you're in the playoffs again baby <laughs> it's, it's, uh, it's fantastic you know it was a tough uh, really tough period uh, in September October beginning uh, beginning of October but uh, you know it's about turning things around and then the group how they responded uh, standing behind me and we're standing together it's, it's been fantastic and and now I'm you know uh, sort of com uh, have confidence into the playoffs we we see players that uh, that take out their potential now and um, we know we can do whatever is possible we can do everything here now and um, home here in the uh, in the playoffs, first game against Atlanta, we, we're going to go for it. And, uh, and then we need the support we had today because that was also uh, was special. Ronnie, there are times that people get a little frustrated of having to put the brakes on the league because of an international break. This one might come at a good time for you. Uh, you have a couple of weeks before the MLS playoffs get underway. What does that mean for Keaton Parks since you know you won't have Gideon Zalalem available because of the red card? Yeah. Well, hopefully you can get uh, Keaton ready. Um, he has a cough issue. Um, we haven't, don't know how uh, how serious it are yet. So um, of course he's an important player for us. But uh, whatever happens, we have a, a good depth in the squad. We see today that uh, we are missing a lot of players. But at the same time, we have players coming and can do the job. So um, I'm very very happy with that. And uh, we want everybody available. But. We're going to have 11 guys on the pitch and uh, hopefully play 11 uh, now against Atlanta <laughs> the whole game. <laughs> and then everything is possible. So just, um, you know, happy for the team and looking forward to the, the playoffs. Ronnie, congratulations. As you said, five games unbeaten to close out the season. A team that's ready for the Audi MLS Cup playoffs. Appreciate a few moments and we're looking forward to the postseason. Thank you. See you, Dan.